What is good, YouTube? It's your boy Kill coming back with another video, man. You already know the vibes. Um, I got another session up. Session I mixed a little while ago. Um, but this ain't no mixing tutorial. As you can see by the title, this is how to use Flex Pitch and Logic Pro. Um, you know, Flex Pitch, if you don't know what it is, it's something like Melodyne, so it's vocal tuning, but it gives you a chance to tune your vocals without having that like straight up t pain travis scott like auto tune type of feel you know what i'm saying so um i think it's pretty dope especially if you're like a really good singer and you know only need like a little something just to put you like perfectly in key maybe you're a little sharp maybe you're a little flat and it's perfect for that um so i'm gonna just go ahead and play this little part of the vocal that we're gonna focus on today and right now it has no auto tune on there you got the plug-in on there but it's disabled the key is e major um, if you don't know how to find the key of a song, you can get auto key, it's like 50 bucks from auto tune and you go ahead and you just put that on your beat track like so and you let the beat play for about 30 seconds or so and then it's going to give you the key and you can also send them to the auto tune. So I'll demonstrate it real quick. Let me just solo this beat and play it. Alright, and that was pretty quick. See, it already gave me the E major, and I already knew this song was in E major. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and disable that. Go ahead and enable our loop again. Alright, so we're going to go back down to this vocal. Alright, so let's play this vocal real quick on solo so you can really hear it. It's not bad. He's a great singer. It's a little bit sharp and a little bit flat on certain notes, but it's not bad. So let's play it. Got a game for us to play right now. Baby, pull up to my side right now. All right, so we want to take that from good to great. You know what I'm saying? So what you want to do, you want to select the vocal that you're trying to pitch, and then you want to go ahead and select flex pitch right here. And then it's going to go ahead and pull up the notes, but I like to look at it down here, so we're going to select it down here too. Now we can see exactly the notes, and we have the option to change a few different things about them. We can change the vibrato. We can go ahead and fine pitch it. So if we wanted to just nudge it a little bit, like if I zoom in, you can see these notes he hit seem like they're straight. But the first thing you want to do is you want to scale quantize it. So we know that it's going to be an E major. So we'll pick E major. And then you want to go ahead and command A to select all of your notes right there. And you want to hit quantize. As you can see, one of those notes just jumped. You know what I'm saying? So we quantized it to the scale. But it can be in the scale and still sharp or flat, you know what I'm saying, which doesn't sound the greatest. So we want this to be basically perfect pitch because that's what most people in the industry ears are used to. They used to auto tune. They used to perfect pitch. They used to Melodyne. So this is the closest thing you can get for free that's built in the logic that's close to Melodyne. So um, now that I got all these notes selected, um, I'm just going to go ahead and straight up go to 100 percent. so as you can see when i straight up go to 100 percent, it shifts every single note that you have selected and if i go to 50 percent, you'll see it shifted so it leaves that little bit of space so the more i zoom in you can see what's going on so he seems like he's just a little bit flat right there so we can just go ahead and do 100 percent, just because he's not that far off so it's not going to sound like it's doing too much work so let's just play it at 100 percent. see what that sounds like got a game for us to play right now Baby, pull up to my side right now. So here you go right there. Flex pitch is that simple. Knowing the key and then setting it. From here, you just use your ear. If you feel like that's too much, which I don't think is too much, that's what I love about flex pitch because it's very transparent. You can't really hear it too much. Um, so I would keep the 100% in this instance because this artist didn't need too much and it just had to nudge it up or down a little bit depending on the note. So that's how you can automatically do it. You can also manually do it by going to one of these points on a note with fine pitch and you can shift the pitch. So if you just had one word or one phrase that you felt like just needed to be pitched and you could do it that way. But a lot of the times I find myself just highlighting a section that I feel like needed it and then just going ahead and using the pitch correction for that. You know, depending on the singer, sometimes I might have to do 50 percent, um, but 100 percent with a good singer that's not far off usually sounds pretty natural and it usually sounds pretty good you know what i'm saying so um i'm gonna play it one more time and then i'm gonna actually throw some auto tune on there so i can show you guys the difference all right so this is it pitched to 100 percent. got a game for us to play right now baby pull up to my side right now I know. all right 
so let me solo it so you guys can really hear it again got a game for us to play right now baby pull up to my side right now all right dope all right so we're gonna take the pitch correction off boom so you as you can see they went back and this one's really 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 sharp right there you see there's a big gap right there these are flat right here all right so um i'm gonna play it without it let you hear it got a game for us to play right now baby pull up to my side right now and as you can hear it's not bad but that 100 percent is just like perfect it's super clean let's hear that 100 percent Got a game for us to play right now Baby, pull up to my side right now All right, so if I was to do the same thing, though, with auto-tune And this is the biggest difference That's why I like this flex pitch And I like Melodyne But a lot of people can't afford Melodyne It's kind of expensive But um, I'm going to go ahead and put this on zero So boom, there's no tuning at all And then we're going to click on the actual track and I'm going to enable this auto-tune. And we're going to push it to 100%. Just so you can hear the difference. Got a game for us to play right now. Baby, pull up to my side right now. There you go. Night and day right there. That's night and day, bro. Like, so, you know, if you want that auto-tune feel, go for it. And you can pull back on the auto-tune, too. It's like, if I put it back, I had it set at 12. Got a game for us to play right now. Baby, pull up to my side right now. And that sounds good, too, but it's a little, you can hear the tune, you know what I'm saying? So if you want to be perfectly in key and you don't want people to necessarily know you're using auto-tune or you just don't want to hear it, you want to sound natural, you want that natural sound, Melodyne or Flex Pitch. If you got logic, just use Flex Pitch, you know what I'm saying? If you know how to use it right, you can finesse it, get the right sound of it, you know what I'm saying, and then just go from there. But that's pretty much it. I'm going to keep this video short and sweet. I appreciate all y'all. Make sure y'all like if this helped you out. Leave a comment and subscribe, man. Come join the fam. Um, I got a lot going on right now. Um, doing a lot of mixing and mastering. Doing a lot of recording sessions. I appreciate all y'all, man. Link will be in the description for my beat stars. I got a few beats up. I got all my services up. Uh, I got Logic Pro templates. Everything you need. Um, so make sure you go ahead and check that out in the description. And also, I wanted to let you guys know. That I have an email list, you know what I'm saying? And I got a landing page. I'm going to put that down in the description too for you guys to go ahead and check me out. I'm going to be hitting you up every week. I'm not spamming nobody. I'm giving y'all real gems, real tips, real tricks, all that. You know what I'm saying? I'm giving y'all the sauce. The stuff that I'm not putting on YouTube, you know what I'm saying? So if you want that exclusive, go ahead and join the email list, man. Join the fam. And I appreciate all y'all, man. That's it for this video. I'm going to catch y'all in the next one. I'm out. Put that shit up, kid.